Hello students, Bill High School. Hope you're all well, hope your families are too. Um, I hope you've been staying active during this time. Um, obviously, physical activity is not only beneficial for your physical health, for your heart and our lungs, our muscles, um, it's obviously good for our mental health as well. Um, it's really important to try and get into some form of routine um, and include some physical activity within that in your daily routine. Um, I personally like getting up in the morning and doing 30 minutes of activity um, and then having a really healthy breakfast and I find it just sets me up for the rest of the day, um, gives me lots of energy and I find that I get more done um, if, I've got in, if I've done that routine. Um, so what I've done is I've selected a few of my personal favourite activities, working the whole body. Um, so what we're going to do, um, I suggest you do a warm up before this, I'm already warmed up, um, to do some form of pulse raiser, you could do jogging on the spot, star jumps, high knees, heel flicks, some lunges, you know, some dynamic stretches as well, some static stretches, okay, so get your body nice and warmed up, do that for about five minutes. Then we're going to go on to the main activity, so I've chosen eight exercises. Um, each exercise we're going to do 10 repetitions um, for um, and I'll, I'll talk through the teaching points and what muscles we're working. Obviously if 10 is too easy you know you can play around with this as much as possible this is just to give you some ideas um, you know you could do 15 repetitions you know if you want to push yourself you can do it for time you could do it for 30 seconds 45 seconds um, and then do multiple rounds of those, okay? So this is just um, a few of my personal favorites, okay? Okay, so all you need is a bottle of water. Um, you can put a mat down if you have one. If you're outside, um, you could just lay a towel down just to save your hands. Um, so the first exercise is going to be mountain climbers. So you need to get Put your weight onto your, your hands and your feet, okay? And all you're going to do is bring your knee up and out, left knee up and out, and that is one, okay? Make it harder, do it a little bit faster, okay? So we're doing doubles, that is equals to one, okay? So we're gonna go for 10. Let's go. So, one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, that's number one, that's mountain climbers. Number two are called plank jacks. You're in a similar position, weight on your hands and your feet, and all you're going to do is jump your feet, both feet out to the side, and then both feet back in again. Okay, so that's one, okay? If that's too hard, you can step one foot out, one foot out, one foot in, one foot in. Okay, so again, for plank jacks, we're gonna go for 10 repetitions. Okay, so when you're ready, let's go for 10. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Our second, ex our third exercise, sorry, is alternate arm and leg extensions. Okay. So on all fours, what you're going to do is take your right leg and your left arm and you're going to bring it in. Okay. That's one two, three, four, five, pulling your belly button into your spine, seven, eight, nine, and ten. We're going to do ten on the other side now, so your left leg and right arm, okay, again pull that belly into your spine, one, two, Three, four, 
seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay. Our fourth exercise, our squat jumps. Okay, if you've got um, sore knees, you can just do normal squats if, if it allows you to. Okay, so a normal squat, feet shoulder width apart, looking to stick our bottoms out, down to about 90 degrees. That's a normal squat. We're going to do squat jumps. Okay, so you're going to touch the floor each time. So we're going to go down, legs in, and down. So that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, so there's the squat jumps. Our fifth exercise is tricep dips. Okay, obviously, to make it harder, you can elevate your hands. Okay, but we're just going to do it on the floor. So, lift your bottoms up. Okay, feet, uh, fingers are facing your heels. And all you're doing is lowering your body down, working your triceps. Let's go. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Number six are plank shoulder, uh, shoulder taps. Okay, so I'm in a plank position. I'll do it front on. Okay, feet should be together at the back and you're aiming to touch your shoulders but keeping your body nice and still. Okay, so pulling that belly button in to your spine really working your whole core here okay so we're going for 10 I've lost count how many I've done so we'll go from five six seven eight nine and ten so that are your plank shoulder taps number seven is working your abdominals okay so we're getting into a sit-up position and you are going to do bicycle crunches okay so you're just bringing the knee to the opposite elbow to make that harder you can hold the position okay so we're going for 10 <clears throat> Let's go. So one, two, three, and ten. Okay, the final exercise is my sheets are blown away. Let's go. So one, two, three. And ten. Okay, the final exercise is my sheets have flown away. Is the rear lunge? Okay, this is working our quadriceps, hamstrings. <coughs> so all you're going to do take the leg back and lunge down. Step forward. Rear lunge. Okay. So, we're going to do 10 on each leg, okay? We're going to focus just on our right leg first of all. So step back, that's one. Right leg again, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now our left leg. Okay. So stepping backwards. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. 
making sure to get 90 degrees through both legs. Eight, nine, and ten. Okay, they are our eight exercises. Okay, as I said before, you can do more repetitions than that. Um, so obviously make sure you're working hard. Um, again, you can do it for time. Um, you know, if you've got a stopwatch, do it for 30 seconds. You know, if you're fitter and you've got um, better muscular endurance, you know, push yourself to 45 seconds to a minute. Okay. Um, I would tend to do maybe three rounds um, of those eight exercises. And you know, you could, you know, we should be really exercising every single day. Um, as I said, you know, the physical benefits, you're not really doing many steps at the moment. Um, so to get that heart rate up um, and you know, you, you release endorphins as well. So you're gonna feel good afterwards. Um, and it's gonna, you know, hopefully make you wanna do, do more with, with your day. Okay, so I hope that helps. Obviously, um, with exercise, you need to be making sure that you're eating well as well. Um, you know, there's no point in doing some exercise and then sitting there and eating lots of sugary foods um, and fatty foods, um, you know, because you're, you know, the balance is, is not quite, um, quite what you need. Um, you know, food, if you're not eating the right foods, that can really affect your mood um, and your energy levels as well okay so I hope that has been um, beneficial for you I'm sure I will be back um, with some more of my favorite exercises take care guys